And not to offend, but life stops and it calls your name. Appears like a finger running through grime, wild like a balloon popped and cue crying from a child. Not just in the trite poetics, the trusty steeds like moonlight or the way the reeds reflect like ghosts upon the water mead. But those seconds, like a whisper in an ear. Not to touch, but to feel, like eyes lingering on autumn's reveal, from windows housing a pressure unreal, and melodrama roughing as real life repeals. Real life. Real life. Waking the dead in the witching hours, sheets twitching as time runs away like mercury overplayed, or something about bones worn by wheels in the day to day, the mainstay of clock in, get paid, clock out again. Go home and lay, quite still, but terrified and feeling ill in the dawn of time and space and life, like blood drawn by a knife, yet somehow unable to make a change, despite the running of that tap, untouched and washer-worn, drip, drip, drip. We'll get this. We're awake and we're scared out our wits by the what-ifs, but fuck it, because that bucket, we're too eager to kick it, it seems. But not while we gather moments like bullets to borrow, a gunboat feeding ammunition as we run towards some end, a fistful of moments pin-sprung and ready to throw, explode. Our time, whether it be today or tomorrow. Cheers.